up, everybody? Hooded Cobra Commander 788 here, and I'm all dressed up because this is a special occasion. I'm going to be doing my first ever unboxing video. This box was sent to me by Arthur at Busy Benz. That's how he wanted to be credited. Uh, Arthur sent me this box unsolicited for the purpose of doing an unboxing video. I haven't done one of these before. I've been thinking about it, and this is a great opportunity to do it. So I've opened the box, but I haven't looked inside yet. Uh, so I'm going to uh, do this on camera so you can see uh, what Arthur has sent to me. I'm very excited to see it. Uh, so let's check it out and let's, uh, let's see. Let's see what we got. This is like Christmas. Let's check it out. Okay, so opening the box and first I see some packing popcorn. Packing pop... Not enough butter. Uh, okay, so let's, uh, what's the first thing we come to? Uh, let's see. Oh, here, here we go. We've got some parts to uh, Checkpoint Alpha. That's cool. I do not have that complete yet. Um, I will have to put this with some other parts that I have, see if we can complete that. And let's see, we also have tripwire. Very nice, complete tripwire. Very good, thank you very much. We have, ooh, look at this. Look at this, Alpine. Alpine and Alpine looks to be complete. That's awesome. I, I don't have a complete Alpine, so that's very cool. Uh, that is definitely something special. Now I've got, there's a bag thing here, and I'm, oh, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There's something in the way, and it's something, oh, check this out. Check this out. It is Tiger Force, the Tiger Rat, and it looks to be in pretty good shape. Landing gear is unbroken. All the clear plastic bits are there. The paint looks good. This is awesome. This is really cool. This, this alone would have made it work, worth it. This is an awesome thing to send. Thank you so much, Arthur. That's so cool. All right, well, <laughs> let's see what else we got. Let's see. Uh, we got, now, I was trying to get this bag out. This bag has more things in it. Let's see. So, oh man, I see more down in there. Oh, this is great. This is great. And a lot of this stuff will show up as a video review. So Arthur, you are helping the channel and helping create more video reviews with this. I guarantee I will be doing this. This is a box. Okay, this is an empty box for the uh, Rock Rampage uh, 50th anniversary set. Very good, got the file cards in there. And let's see, we have, look at this. Look at this. This is a still on the card. Um, Iron Grenadier's uh, 25th anniversary Destro with the gold head. This is really cool. I don't think I'm going to take it off the card. I hate taking things off the card. Um, I just feel like I'm ruining it. So I like this looks really pretty on the card. So I'm going to keep that in the package. That's cool. Not a bad Destro. Cool. Um, all right. And let's see what else we got. Okay. We've got uh, some modern figures here. We've got, let's see. Uh, let's see. Oh. Uh, I see a Baroness, and uh, oh, there's Torpedo, and a Cobra Eel, and yeah, the Baroness. Okay, so um, I'm going to take some pictures of these so you can see each of these individually, uh, and I will cut that in uh, to the video. So we've got some great modern uh, figures here. You know, you normally do vintage, but I have reviewed some modern stuff from time to time, so I may have to give those a look. You know, maybe I'll branch out into some modern reviews. Speaking of which, here is a Zartan, um, and looks like a modern um, Python Patrol, uh, uh, yeah, Python Patrol uh, Crimson Guard um, with file card. Awesome, awesome. And okay, so we've got some packaging here for some of the modern figures. There is, oh, look at that. That's a modern bat. Nice detail on that. I, I may have to, you know, just for the special occasion because Arthur went through the trouble of sending these to me, I may have to review some modern stuff just because now I have it. And uh, now I can really take a look at it. Let's slide this out of the way. There's so much in this bag. Look at all these file cards, tons of file cards. Oh, we've got, oh, Flash. Check that out. Sergeant Flash, excellent, cool. And we've got Storm Shadow. And we've got a Snow Serpent. Now, I'm gonna have to look these up to see like what years these were released because I'm not as familiar with the 
modern figures as I am the uh, vintage figures. Uh, most of the vintage figures, especially the 80 ones, like uh, 1980s ones, I've got memorized and I can tell you what year they came from, but not so much the modern figures. And so this gives me an opportunity to learn more, which I always appreciate. I'm never opposed to learning. Uh, so this is, that is a really cool bag. Uh, this, that's some awesome modern stuff right there. Uh, so I'm going to uh, set these aside over here so we can dig in some more. Um, and I see some vintage stuff. I see some vintage stuff. Okay. Oh, look at that. The rest of the parts for Checkpoint Alpha. This is one that I've been, I've had an eye on to do a review um, and it looks to be complete. There's the clipboard right there. So uh, this, I may have to review this one in the very near future. Uh, so that's, that's awesome. And then uh, we've got a big bag of stuff here. Oh, wow. Oh, here, here we got, some, this is smaller, but this is uh, some figures. We got some figures here. We've got, oh yeah, look at that. We've got uh, Naga Hyde. Uh, we've got, oh, who's that guy? Oh, that's the, the what, the Sea Slug? I think uh, the Cobra um, submarine driver uh, was, uh, yeah, it looks really good. And we've got, looks like Mercer and... Nemesis Enforcer from Cobra Law, and we have we have Blowtorch, 1984. Not a bad Blowtorch there. Um, I'll need to. I, I've been also thinking about Blowtorch because there are some variants with Blowtorch that I haven't uh, nailed down yet. So I'll have to check and see what I've got, and maybe this will help me uh, progress toward a Blowtorch review. So that would be very exciting. And so, all right, now we got a big bag of vintage stuff here. Let's check this out. Now this is, I mean, I, this is, I'm not gonna go through each of these because it's, it's uh, parts mainly, but I can tell from just looking at it. I mean, we got some parts of the killer whale here, um, more parts of the killer whale. These are awesome. We've got a ton of missiles. Um, the missile box from the um, Wolverine from 1983. Uh, I'm gonna spend some time, this is gonna be, this is going to be awesome. I'm going to, this evening, I'm going to be going through this because this is, this is like Christmas. This is so cool. The RCB recon sled, a uh, little shell of that there. Got some accessories. This is awesome. And you know, these missiles, it's always such a pain to try to find missiles when you're missing one. And it, this is probably going to complete some things for me uh, because, just because of the missiles in this bag. So that's, that's so cool. I'm going to set this down here. Uh, and I, I'm definitely going to spend some more time going through that. What else we got? Well, look at this. We got a a bag o low lights. We got four low light action figures in there. That's awesome. You know, I do like low light. I mean, he was a good figure, and so that's so cool. Um, and oh my God, look at all this figure parts. Figure parts. I may be able to. I may be able to fix some figures with these. I can see some th uh, in here that that I potentially need here. Um, we got a Crimson Guard. Um, we got who that? Uh, we got uh, half of Big Boa. Um, this is another thing that I'm going to spend more time going through. But I can tell from looking at it right now that this is going to help me. This is. Some of these uh, have parts that are in much better shape than the figures I already have. And so I will be using these to complete a few things. Yeah, look at that. It's got uh, my Zap from 1982, my Zap action figure, has a heel broken. Because you know that that soft, uh, brittle plastic breaks so easily. There, were, Right there, some intact uh, Zap legs. Beautiful, beautiful. So that's really cool. All right. Oh, that's cool. Okay, setting that aside now, because there's more. There is more in here. There is, okay, look at this. Look at this. Carded. Carded, uh, yeah. Uh, carded uh, Python Patrol Elite Trooper, Trooper. Look at that. That's gorgeous. That's awesome. Uh, G.I. Joe Club. That's so cool. So, you know, I don't have, um, and this is a modern figure, you know, I don't have a lot of Tiger Force or Python Patrol, but those two subgroups I've been wanting to 
kind of jump into and and get more of them. And this is, I mean, this is a nice modern version of the Python Control uh, Crimson Guard. That means I'm going to have to go and get the vintage uh, figure uh, so that I can do a review. I'm, this is all going to be awesome. And look at all those accessories. Look at all of these accessories. You know what I'm going to do? Accessory baths. I've got to put these in a bathtub and take a bath with accessories. Look at all these accessories. This is awesome. I, I mean, I'm just just glancing from the outside of the bag, I can see some that that I've needed. Um, so uh, this is that's that's gorgeous. I'm going. This is all right. This unboxing video is not going to you know be very long, but this is going to take hours to go through and those will be happy hours this will be the best time i've had with gi joe for a while the opportunity to spend some time going through this stuff and curating it it's gorgeous it's beautiful and it slaughters marauders i don't have any slaughters marauders figures at least i didn't until now this is great you know and this is a, that's another sub team that i hadn't quite delved into yet but it's one that had been on the agenda well you know what that's a good start right there. There's uh, uh, Slaughter's Marauders, uh, Barbecue, and Low Light, a couple of those. That is great. This is, this is, can it get any better? Can it get any better? All right, well, we've got some full card backs. We've got some full card backs, modern cards. Look at that. And so that's, uh, yeah, from the G.I. Joe cartoon series. Uh, the, uh, let's see, Snow Serpent. And uh, it's the Python Patrol, Crimson Guard, Laser Rifle Trooper, Trooper Flash. We saw the Flash action figure in there, as we also saw the Eel um, and the Cobra Android Trooper. That's, that's, this is, this is, you know, again, I'm a vintage collector, but uh, seeing some of the cool modern stuff, um, I, I'm still really excited to see it. I mean, this is, this stuff just looks cool. Um, and, uh, and you know what, I, it almost requires a review, doesn't it? I almost have to do it. Still on the card, Spirit Iron Knife and Storm Shadow 50th Anniversary. Uh, no, I didn't have those before. Um, and this uh, Spirit Action figure in particular was one that had intrigued me and that I wanted to take a closer look at. So uh, now I will be able to. So this, I mean, some of this stuff is, look at this. Look at all these file cards. That's that's a ton of file cards. I'm gonna spend probably an hour or two just going through these file cards. That's awesome. Oh, look at this, more, more vintage stuff. Oh, look at that, that's the missiles and stuff from the Tiger Rat, and that looks like uh, that Sky Striker pilot. Look at that. This is, this is, this is wonderful. This is, uh, that, that's, that may be the showstopper of this whole box. And here we go, we got some vintage, oh yeah, Heat Viper. I've got an incomplete Heat, heat Viper with the uh, accessories on here. I'll have to check, but that may help me complete that figure. That figure may be complete now. You know, a complete figure means it uh, can be reviewed at any time. Uh, we got some file cards, his tank driver, um, let's see, Torpedo, uh, Storm Shadow, Vipers, Raptor. Uh, I don't have Raptor yet, uh, but you know what? That, believe it or not, that's one I'm looking forward to reviewing. I, I, no joke, I'm looking forward to reviewing that, that figure. So uh, now that I've got the file card, I'm one step closer. Uh, let's see, it just never ends. My gosh. Um, let's see, this here is the, is it the law? Yeah, I think that's what it was. And it looks to be complete. Just snap the seat back in there. There you go, looking good. And let's see, um, more vintage figures, and now I can't get enough vintage figures. There's a, this is great. There's a Storm Shadow, there's a Crazy Legs. It looks like a Motor Viper. It looks like uh, a Junkyard is in there. Uh, and even some accessories. All right, and, you know, and it, you, know, you give me some vintage figures and I'm gonna be your best friend. I, 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 because this is what, this is what G.I. Joe still uh, uh, is for me. This is what brings back all those memories and what makes G.I. Joe so awesome. There's a Thunder Machine. Everybody loves Thunder Machine, right? Everybody loves Dreadnoughts? If not, well, well, you should. There's Thunder Machine. That is, 
that is that's clean. It looks good. It looks tight. That's a that's that's a nice that's a nice example of a thumb machine. Let's stick that armor plate back on there. Looks great. Looks great. More packing popcorn. More vintage figures. Look at this. Look at this. Look at that. I can't. You got iceberg. You got uh, lifeline. Uh, who else is in there? Uh, looks like a kind of a Frankenstein uh, zap action figure. I see uh, clutch. Uh, there's the stinger driver. This is there. Oh, there's a stalker. I see a stalker action figure in there. Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Well, obviously that this is great. So, um, wow. Okay, I'm a little overwhelmed. Okay, I hope hope I can make it through this video. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Figure stands. I was just lamenting the other day that I was out of figure stands and I needed some more. Well, that, you know what? That's going to do me for a while. I'm good on figure stands. That is exact. I mean, it's like you read my mind. All right, so how are we doing? How are we doing? Uh, let's see. We get everything from this side. I think we're good. All right, and then, okay, more. Oh, look at that. Croc Master. Croc Master and Crocodiles. Look at that. And a, a bunch of them. And that's so cool. I, you know, I didn't have a Croc Master complete. Um, and this will help me get closer to completing that. It's, and, and I didn't have the Crocodile. Um, or the alligator. I think it's it's actually an alligator, even though I call it a crocodile. But that's uh, that's great. That's great. So, you know, some of these figures you may not think that I'm looking forward to reviewing, but it's not true. I want to review everything in the vintage line, and even if it's a fit, not a figure that I think is a top tier figure or I think is weird, I still look forward to reviewing it. And uh, and so I am absolutely looking forward to reviewing uh, Croc Master. So. Uh, I think that's it. I hope I didn't miss anything. I, I don't think I did. Uh, I'm going to take some pictures of this so I can uh, put them with the video because I know it's a little far away so you may not be able to see everything, but I'll try to make sure that uh, you can see what I'm talking about here. Uh, so Arthur, thank you. This is my first ever unboxing video. You didn't have to do this. You really don't. Uh, you, you didn't have to, but you did it just out of your own generosity and I appreciate it. This absolutely will benefit the channel. This will help keep the channel going. Uh, it'll help complete some things things and you know, I've been so busy lately I haven't really been able to you know do the toy hunting that I usually do but you know what this this actually solves that problem a little bit it, it just you, you sent it to me and I'm going I promise that it all has a good home and I'm going to make the best possible use out of it so thank you thank you very much and to everybody else thanks for watching this first ever unboxing video i hope you enjoyed it uh, i'm excited and and if you like the reviews you ought to be excited too because i've got some more stuff to review now this is this is going to uh, propel the channel forward and uh, give me more stuff to do more stuff to look at so uh, i think that'll be it thank you very much again arthur thanks for watching i'll see you next time uh, and keep watching for more vintage gi joe toy reviews keep watching for some of this stuff to be reviewed in the near future i'll see you next time